A supermodel's secret sister revealed. As Janice Dickinson was publicly accusing Bill Cosby of rape, a long-lost sibling that she never knew emerged. Senior correspondent Tara Burney was there as our cameras rolled when the two met for the first time. And it's a Daily Mail TV exclusive that you'll only see here. My heart was pounding out of my chest. Janice Dickinson is talking about the emotion-filled moment just before she and sister Alexis met their long-lost older sister, Gloria Bunny Dickinson. The spry 84-year-old Bunny says she was an admirer of the famous supermodel throughout her life, but Bunny says she had no clue she was actually related to Janice. The irony is when I used to watch her on television, I always kind of felt a kinship without any reason to do that, but there were so few people with D-I-C-K-I-N-S-O-N that I was paying attention. The way I thought I could maybe prove that this was true is I sent them a copy of my birth certificate. That's true. And I thought, if they see the signature, they'll know whether that's their father's signature or not. He had a very specific way of signing. And from that point on, we didn't have to prove anything else. Janice grew up with her two sisters, Alexis and Debbie, all daughters of Samuel Raymond Dickinson and their mom, Jenny Marie. Bunny was born 20 years earlier to Samuel Ray and his first wife, Viola Logan. Your mom and your father. My were, dad, our dad. Were only married for about a year, a correct? Year. I didn't correct. know him in any way. No birthday card, nothing. I only met my father one time for lunch, and I never saw him again. Since meeting, the sisters say they have a lot in common, including a father with very dark traits. He was physically abusive, and he was verbally abusive, and he was also sexually abusive. Despite the family trauma, for the Dickinson sisters, there's a happy ending at last. This is the most insane thing that's ever happened to me, and a lot has it's happened have to me. It's like a sister kinship. Yes. It's like chains of love. Janice says that now that she's found Bunny, they plan to stay in constant contact and have already planned the next visit at her home in L.A.